Today, me and the old ham dog are heading off down a track to a, a beautiful camping spot that I used to come down to when my dad was still around. And um, it was his birthday a few days ago, so I thought I'd take the old papa camping down there for the night, do a bit of crabbing, do a bit of fishing. It's the kind of track that you probably shouldn't tow a trailer down, but uh, we're gonna do it anyway. Because there's a little creek at the mouth that I've never had a boat in, and I wanna see where it goes. So anyway, stay tuned for this one. You get hit by a tree with pollen on it, girl. <laughs> oh dear. Let's go. Oh, a bit boring, is it, mate? Don't worry, it's about to get lively. We made it. Look at this. This is just beautiful. Oh, the weather is mint. It's a little bit chilly, but it'll be good tonight with a fire. Have a look at that. No one around. Got the whole beach to ourselves. How good is this? Oh, love it. There's my islands. So this is the little creek that I want to put the boat in. Obviously no boat ramps around here. So we're going to have to make one. That's the mouth of the creek. <laughs> so you ain't getting in from out the front. Not a chance. So we're gonna just try and put the boat in here. Old Hemi is living her best life. All right, let's do it. I'm excited. This is gonna be a good weekend. Alrighty, now we gotta get this boat in the drink. That's gonna be the tricky part. Uh, the tide is not not in, obviously, so, and there's nothing to winch off over here. So, I'm thinking, drop the trailer in there and just wait. I'll be able to drive out of that, no worries. Once the water comes in far enough, away we go. What do you reckon, M Dog? I reckon we could nearly get it in, eh? It's not far, Hemi, get out of the water. Get out or I'll tie you up. This isn't like the last place we went camping. There is crocs in this one. Reckon I'm just gonna go back that little bit more there and then I'll, I'll be in. I'm done, I'm laughing. Reckon we'll be all right. Now, if we just drive forward, that should work, shouldn't it? Give it a go. I'd call that a win. Yes, now we can have a beer. Let's do that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Come on. Well, it's dead low tide and the boat's too heavy to move by myself, so might as well soak up a bit of scenery, go get some firewood. I even brought Hemi a chair because she usually well, claims mine straight away and she's not even using it. Unbelievable. That'll do. Usually wait till it's dark before I worry about that sort of shit. I'm so close. I'm buggered, but I've nearly got the boat in. Oh. Nearly there.
We flighting. I did all the hard work off camera because you just would have heard me nearly shit myself. So, all right, let's get in the boat. Come on, girl. All righty, let's go. Yee -hee. Oh, I'm excited. I sent the drone up before to have a look at this creek. I'll show you now. It's a lot bigger than I thought it was. You know, the mouth of it made you think that it was tiny and didn't go anywhere, but looks pretty good. I wish I had a sounder or a battery. I do have a sounder, but I don't even have a battery in this boat. The new boat is done. It should be getting painted next week. Uh, and then fit it out and we're good to go. Well, they got to make a trailer, but man, that's exciting. So this boat will be for sale, guys, if you want this boat. Get a free dog. Anyway, let's get exploring. Wonder how deep it is. It is dead low tide right now too, so I know no matter how far up I go, I'll be able to get back to get the pots. Holy shit, there's some bait in here. I do have a cast net, and I didn't bring dinner. That's like me and Hemi's thing, you know? We go camping, she gets to eat, and I don't. Or we eat mullet, if you saw that last video. If you didn't, I'll link it in the corner so you can watch it. But yes, oh, this is so good, man. It's so good. I love this shit. So there's a split in the creek up here. I just went up one way, and you gotta get around a tree, so. I'll do that later. I just want to get these pots in the water so they're doing some work while I'm not. Oh. Dan, the Harley man's ringing. Hey, mate. Hello. No phone signal. You there? Nah. It'll ring, but you can't talk. Anyway, I'm gonna go up this way. Check this out, this is cool. I don't reckon many boats go up here. Watch out, Ams. This would be hard on high tide, actually. Oh, that would have got it too. Emmy, sit down. Good girl. Oh yeah, I'm excited. All right, let's bait these pots. Got the pot spreaders back in stock too, guys, on the website. If you missed out last time, you can get one now. Make life a hell of a lot easier with these pro pots. They're pretty stiff to set up. Skidpig.com I'd leave there if I was a crab. Three more to go. Dan the Harley man's supposed to be coming down after work today. So there's four more pots up at the car with his name on the tags and floats, obviously, because that's the law. And um, once he gets here, we can chuck another four in. So I just gotta wait. Look at that big hole. Right near a little gutter. Oh, oh. I know crabbing's pretty hard work when it gets cool and it is pretty cold at the moment, but hopefully we just need a feed. That's all I want. I'm not a greedy man. Come on. We're good. Today is not the day to go exploring up there, but I will. Bomb the way. One more. One more. Just using mullet heads for bait today. 
I can get them out. I picked up some of this garlic in hand scent spray. So I've already broken the cap. We'll see if that works. Did all right last time. Look at the midges. I've got to get some Aerogard on. I'm getting caned. All right, let's get this one in the drink. It smells good. I think we'll just go right in the middle of the creek for this one. What do you reckon, Hems? My work here is done. Let's go sit in a camp chair and drink a beer. Good climbing, sir. That was impressive. They could definitely get in your rooftop tent if they wanted to, eh? <laughs> Shit. Oh, one throw. Have a go at this for a throw of the cast net. Not bad. That's our live bait sorted. Oh, just drop one, you're joking. Beautiful. Nice little fella. A few more mullet too. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, we got our bait. Let's chuck a livey on and hope for dinner. Dan the Harley man's here. Someone to have a beer with. All right, Dan's just rocked up to camp, so now we can put the other four pots in. Here you go, buddy. Yeah, good. G'day, people. How are you? That's great. Fantastic. Keep down the level, eh? So we'll just have a quick hydration session and then get back into the action. You can use Hemi's chair if you want. We got liveys. I had a live mullet out there. I don't know if it's actually still there or not, but. No. Oh. I can see what's happening here. She knows it's her chair, bud. That's okay. what happens. You can sit down, but mm. she gets to sit on you. Inside me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even cold, girl. Oh! Got a bit of frisky. What are you doing? Filming. Oh. <laughs> you got a job for that, eh? For my only pause channel. <laughs> only pause? <laughs> only. <laughs> only. If only. <laughs> if only. Eight hours later. Righty, eh? Time to bait these pots and get them in the drink. So we only got four working for us at the moment. G'day. How are you? Yeah, you've already said that, mate. No, I didn't. Oh yeah! Trap pot time! Oh yeah. Where are you gonna go, Hammy? You eat that? Go on, in you get. Always waiting on Dan. Hammy! It's going to be one of those times again, Hemsey. You don't need to push this out, just oh. jump in. Still, you're told. Shut up. You just want me to straddle it, that's what you want to do. You up and in. No, no, fuck. No. You, you don't have to push off, you're fine. Ah, sleep in your bed. How's that going for you? You just got to push this off. Why didn't you push us off? Oh hey! For some people just like to watch the world burn. Can't Ems. That's 
got in four pot locations. Just let me know where you want them. I don't know. In the water be good. Where do you want one? Yeah. Chuck it in then. What? Oh, no one said anything about that. What about up there? No. It looks the same. No, it doesn't. Do I have to turn around? Yeah, you do. Bombs away. Yeah. Quickly! No, there's a lot more creek Quickly. to explore. You don't have to put all your pots in I do. five meter radius, mate. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. There, yeah, all one in there. There, to the, to the groove, to the hole. Yep. All one That's a good spot. Mm -hmm. I approve of that location. You gotta say bombs away. See ya. Bombs are weird. Nice! Sick. Oh, that looks nice and crabby in there. I like that. Uh, I'm itch just thinking about it. <laughs> oh! Oh! That one's gonna hurt. We had a casualty. It's a rookie oh. error. Maybe we... Dude, nah, we'll, we'll... I don't know what that is. But look at the ripples coming up here. I think we're saying oh, area. I don't think many boats come up here, dude. Right. It's a little bit hectic up here. Jacks. I reckon there'd be mangrove jacks up here. We didn't even bring a fishing rod. Nope. <laughs> You reckon up against them mangroves? Yeah, I mean, they get a walk. I reckon more here. And if they are there, they're going to walk over anyway. Yeah, I just mean, in the middle? Yeah. Oh, I reckon, sir. That'll do, donkey. Yeah. That'll do. Bombs away. I don't like that. Too bad. Alrighty, we're done. Pots are in. Yeah. Nothing to see here. Move along. Right. You uncheck mine? Yeah. We'll They've been in for a little while. And look at all the holes. Yeah, I like this creek. Still didn't bring air gun. Get this... Yeah. Alright, here we go. Pot number one. It's been about two or three hours. Does it? I think so. Let's go up. Let's have a squeeze. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Got a few. Four. That one's a keeper. Four crabs, or oh, maybe two keepers. Two, maybe. Ooh. Oh, come upside down, have a looky. Nice. We'll sort this out. It's going to be hard with Hemi, so I'll turn the camera off. We'll be back. Look at the size of that. It's not bloody bad, eh? Yeah. Shame it's not legal. Yeah. She's undersized that one. Bugger. Well, he's undersized. Yeah, it is a he. Only just under, but still. See you, buddy. Just tip him out. It's a hell of a lot easier. Who wants to see Dan get bit by a crab? I fucking guarantee you, no one's gonna say no to that. <laughs> it's gonna happen. And if they do, I'm gonna argue with the form. The fact that they're saying, why would you not want to see that? Oh, oh, that one's bigger than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> yeah, one's a keeper, dude, I'm telling you. Ow. Can you please? It's gonna be dark. No, same. it's not. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah. 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 That's why we use the plunger. Not bad. Rusty buck. There are balls. 
I can't see. No. Too small. Too small. Legal in the territory. That's a damn shame, man. Well, that's a 40 too. Yeah. That'll be good. Let him go. All right. Oh. That's way too small as well. Deceiving, eh? I'm joking. You know we're coming back. Oh yeah, give it a month. Yeah. Bugger! In case you didn't know, you see I'm sitting back now. I've had an experience. Yeah? Sitting too close to the edge one time. <laughs> we didn't film it though. No. Which is probably good. It's like all the good things yeah. are never caught on camera. No. There's a crab. There is a crab. There's, There's a few. Want a few? That's, That's a big, Jenny. Jenny. There's a couple of littleies. Five crabs and a cod. Yeah. And I don't think any no, of those are be size. No. Bugger. Maybe we should just oh, dump them out and we'll move the pot, eh? Yeah. Here we go. Oh. Sounds like someone's at our camp. I hope they don't drink our beer. Just take the car. One Lone Ranger. So it looks to be... More towards the mouth. Yeah. All right. Well, there you go, eh? Back to the ocean. There's a crab. Yeah. There's definitely more crabs out the front, I think. That one might be all right. Maybe. Oh, they might go up. That's a lot. We'll go up. Yeah, we'll sort them on the bank. Too hard in the boat with the dog. Good numbers in this little creek anyway. Like, once they get a little bit bigger, give it a month or two, I'll definitely come back, I think. If this if this boat hasn't sold, I'll put my new one in here. Our waterfront views. Lovely. Hey, mate. Let's have a crowd party. That's a good buck. Reckon it's legal? I reckon it is. Give it a squeeze. Yeah. <laughs> Watch your feet, bud. Oh, how hard is this shit to do? Yeah, buddy. That one's good. Take your time, mate. Run away. Nah. Have a sleep in there, champion. Oh, look at that one. That's a good. It's got to be legal, that one. Yeah, give us a look. Hold on. Ah, don't try to get it to bite me, you dick. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, there you go. He's good. Yeah, it's on the money. Lovely. Oh, I like that. Oh, I don't reckon any of the other ones are any good, mate. Just I don't know, there's one or two, they might be. Yeah, no, they'll. That one's empty anyway. See you later, little champions. You've been rejected, you guys. Too small. Catch us later. I think it's about time to get the fire going. We need to get some good coals for these mud crabs because we are eating like kings tonight. No mullet on the menu. 
Rifle are ready. Dog ready. Dan ready. Bit more uh, little shit to go, and then we're we're set. No, it's not going to break. You reckon coconut's going to work? I don't know. It's got a burn, doesn't it? Surely. We'll find out. Yeah. There we go. Now we're cooking with two stroke. Little update. We're just sitting around. The tide is super slow here. I know the mouth is real small, but we got the fire going. We got camp set up. Hey. Got the old boom box pumping. Old hem dog's got the jumper on. It's getting a bit chilly. I forgot my jumper, but I remembered hers. Well done. So we're waiting on good coals, but we've got the old grill going. So what do you reckon? We'll just bang a couple of muddies on there. It's definitely hot enough. What do you reckon? Yeah, I reckon give it a go. I've only cooked them in coals before. Yeah, we'll put them there, see what they do. Yeah. We might have to flip them all. Yeah. That'd be right. All right, we'll go get them out. If not, we'll put a little like coal area beside. Yeah. Hemi's on the rope because, yeah, snapping handbags here. Nice rusty buccaroni. There should be another one in there, yep, there he is. Oh, can close that. Not bad. Righto, we don't want like flames, so I reckon just over this side. On their back, I reckon. Yeah. There you go. On. Too big. That's what you said to me at the drive in. Yeah, and then I realised it wasn't you. <laughs> we just doing one at a time. Well, Jordan. Nah, we'll do one at a time, eh? Either that or remove this out and we just put one in there. On in coals? Yeah. Or why don't we just shovel some coals out? Yeah. Yeah, right, right we'll do that. Good coals. I like Woolworths better. You reckon? I don't know. Depends what I'm buying, eh? And which one you go to? There you go. What's better, Woolworths or Coles? Let us know. Check some more on it. I don't think we need it, dude. Very good. No. Ah. That'll be all right. So we'll see what's better, the old coal grilled or actually grilled grilled. Give it the old taste test. What do you reckon? Give it a go, eh? I've done it on coals before and it's good, but I know you shouldn't really do it with flame, so that's not really on flame, so you gotta try it, see what works. We'll let you know. Dinner time. Yep. Oh, I can we, smell it. I know. We had a bit of a, um, a heating issue. Yeah. We're a bit hot. As bit, you can see, we're a bit hot. That's all right. But no, they're One cooked. little burnt spot, that's fine. The one on the coals, we just topped up a bit with coals. So I think we're golden. We just got to find somewhere to put them to cool them down. Oh, so that fellow can just sit there and cool down for a bit. Does look good. Gonna get the other one to do the same? Yeah. As per usual, no plates, no nothing. 
So we eat on the ute. Oh. Which one do you reckon is going to taste better? The one cooked in a pot. <laughs> Tomorrow. <laughs> Dinner time. Let's have a go at this. This guy here on the grill. This guy here on the coals. What should we go first? I don't know. Oh, no, give me north. Hopefully it's cooked. Is it cooked? I don't know. <laughs> you eat it. No. I don't think it's cooked. No. Put it back. Spit it. Alright. Back on the fire. Back on the fire. <laughs> so we're going to put these back on the fire and <laughs> we'll cook them. Yeah. Apparently properly. they can just go red and not cook. Yeah. yeah. Don't let colour deceive you boys and girls. <laughs> Yummy. Not cooked. <laughs> <laughs> now surely that's cooked. Uh -huh. oh. The swimmer burnt off. Oh, I went first last time, so you'll go. Mmm. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> yep. <Yeah. sighs> that didn't work. It's steamy. I reckon they're done. That looks better. Doesn't look like jelly. I reckon it's hot. Mm. Cool. That's way better, yep. That's good. All right, let's take them off, let them cool down. Smokes in my eyes. All right, let them cool down. Take two. Surely, surely. Maybe you need a bit of black on the shell when you're cooking on the coals and burn the swimmers off. You don't eat swimmers anyway. Nah, no meat in them. Nah. Oh, that looks better. Doesn't look jelly. Round two. That's nice. A little bit of the smoky flavour too. Mmm. I can get down by it. Can do it too. Yeah. Here we go. Now I'll <laughs> feed it to you. Open wide. I'm going to do that aeroplane One, thing, <laughs> and then I go... Two, or you get the smacks. <laughs> oh! <laughs> yeah, that's cooked. That's good, eh? <laughs> that's how you peel the crab, boys and girls. I thought there was going to be more in that, then. That's good. Do you hear that? Dude, there's something out there. 100 percent Getting old Blair Witch on me over here. You talking about my belly rumbling or what? <laughs> Maybe that is it. <laughs> I'm tipping that's what it is, because I'm starving, dude. Can you, is it rumbling? Is it seriously going Yeah, yeah, it was. Dude, it sounded like a fucking <laughs> triceratops coming up or some shit. <laughs> fucking diplodocus. Yep, that's me, Dino. <laughs> Get in the pub here. Ah, all right. Time to feast. We'll be back later. So my personal opinion, I like the coals, cooked on the coals one better than cooked on the grill. I think you get a bit of a smoky flavour to it. And it seems to come out of the shell better. Don't know if that's the crab or the cooking method, but that's my pick. 
Beautiful. What? It's not how you make pottage. But it is how you make pottage. Oh, it's cunt. definitely not. All right, this is how Dan cracks crab shells. All right. Too many nights spent alone in bed. Absolutely. Gives you that grip. Mm, good grip. <laughs> Not very full, but that's how you get your lollipop, Dan. Yeah, right, a little wing. <laughs> that's that's embarrassing, but <laughs> she said, tastes good. If you didn't say that. Hmm. You got to work it out, eh? Like the coals and the heat. Oh yeah, it's, there's definitely an art to it. Yeah. It's not like boiling them. You can no. boil crabs all day every day and it's perfect once you get your timing right. But On the coals, oh, probably a few less beers. Same thing. A few less beers. Oh, I reckon, or a few more and then you, probably a few more because then you wouldn't give a shit. Yeah. A few more and... You don't care what they taste like. Yeah, that's right. It all tastes like ice cream. If it makes a poo in the morning, you've had dinner. That's how it goes. It probably tastes like it too. But anyway... Dinner is done. We're gonna go watch the fire and enjoy the stars and all that sort of stuff. And maybe we'll be back or maybe you'll see us in the morning. We don't even know. So, cheers. Good morning. Have a go at that. Fracker of a sunrise. Well, pretty much nothing happened last night. There was a couple of visitors down here, so we just, I had a yarn with them and said good day and yeah sat around the fire and that's about it Ooh. now we gotta go get the pots and yes hemi was in the tent with me so she's here somewhere hemi oh, yeah. i like you you little cuddle buddy God's country. Let's go. You want to get the far away ones first or what? Yeah, mate. Well, I can. And just bring them all back to the beach? Yeah. Be easier than sorting them out with Hammy. Yeah. Let's see how far we can stack them up. That sounds good. Really peaceful here this morning. No wind, no nothing. No birds. It's weird. Okay, so the water's a bit higher, so this is a bit harder. Watch out, Hemi, that'll knock you clean out. The things we do for mud crabs. What do we got? First pull. Quite a second pull of the night, not the morning. The midnight one don't count, dude. <laughs> It's a kid friendly show, mate. Oh, there's a crab in there. Oh, there's one good follow down the back. There's three in there. Three. So what we're gonna do, we're just gonna leave them in the pot. We'll take them back down to the beach and we'll sort them out there because it's a bit hard with Hemi in the boat. I'm sure she'll be all right, but on the off chance she's not. Yeah, so anyway. We were sort of feeling this spot yesterday. Had that sort of crab country feel about it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a good buck, dude. Not bad. That's a good buck. 
<laughs> One stonker. Yee -hee. Thank you too, close hams. You'll regret it. Looks like a good spot. Little gutter there. Quiet creek. Predictions? That'd be a crab in there. Has to be. Is it a legal crab? They're the only ones I care about. No. Heaps of little ones. Lots of little ones. That's like a little, little nursing area there. Like five or six yeah. babies. That's shit. One, two, three, four, five, six. Reckon hams? Feel heavy? Oh, there's one. <clears throat> okay. Only two. two. Oh, he might be all right. Well, they all seem to be at the mouth of the creek, so lucky that's where the rest of the pots are. Let's go get them. All right, come on. Give me some honey. Money, 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 money. Oh, I can see a crab. Oh, it's a good crab. Oh, that's a good crab too. Oh, there's a few in there. Holy moly. Okay, okay. Yeah, right, eh? Yeah, we'll take that, we'll take that. That's a good pot. We'll sort that out on the beach, I think. Yes. See, no sinking rope on this. That's why it was bullshit. Just floats wherever it wants. Yep. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven crabs. Eight crabs. Maybe one keeper. Sort them on the beach. It's way easier. Oh, there's a lot in there. There is. There's one with stonking nippers. Oh, he's, oh, he's so close, dude. That one there, so yeah, yeah I reckon he's he's good. He's, he's definitely yeah, good. He's right. Yeah, that's a good crab. He's alright. Good on you, Kevin. Good on you, Kevin. He's got some barnacles on that bastard too. There's a few barnacle ones in here. That's what I like. For any young fellas. So I reckon we might have probably another two. But this this joint to be popping in about a month or two, I reckon, but cold weather. It is cold. For us, yeah. Not for anyone who actually experiences cold weather, this is completely fine, but for North Queenslanders, this is what we call bullshit. You need fire, you need jackets, which I didn't bring. Anyway, sort these crabs out. That's legal, that's legal. Oh, I think this fella's too small. That's probably legal. One. Two, three. Like good haul of crabs. That's fantastic. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Don't forget to put the fire out before you go home. Don't want a little kid standing on it. Alrighty. So whenever you have a really good weekend, there's always that one thing that gets you, you know? Doesn't matter what you're doing, where you are. And this is my one thing. Oh well. At least we got a winch and a Hilux. That should do us. Happy days. I forgot the track. <laughs> That's why you don't do this shit by yourself, boys yeah. and girls. Alrighty, Dan the Harding man's going home. Alright, peoples, have fun. Party. See you later. <laughs>